All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Azza, uh, the series where I answer your questions. Today, you get to watch me find some sweet rolls, aka ancient debris. But before we get into that last episode, I asked you guys if you liked the music in the background, and most of you said you did, but it was a bit too loud. So I turned it down by two volume, like, so now it's on volume eight instead of ten. So let me know if that's better, and real quick, I just want to say that if you enjoy the music, you can both listen and download it for free. So yeah, I um I download or I bought it. I paid a dollar for it, even though it's free to show my support. But if you like it, you can download it for free. So click the link in the description. But anyways, enough of all that. That was a long intro. Let's get into the question, starting with. Ace Gamer Studios, and he says, Do you think Avatar The Last Airbender will return in LEGO? And have you watched watched it? And if so, what do you think of it about it? Um, to answer the second question, first, no, I've never seen the show. Um, not really. I don't really care, honestly. Um, I've never seen it, so I couldn't really say if it's good or not. Um, and... To answer the first question, honestly, no, I don't think we'll ever see uh, Avatar return in, like, the form of Lego, um, because of licensing and all that crap. Um, it could take, like, a year or two just to get all the licensing working out. Is that a word? Licensing? Uh, get licensed to, like, produce products again. Um, and it would take probably, like, a year just for them to design the sets and release them. So, like, if we were going to get new avatar sets and I could be wrong here. Um, but if we were going to get new sets, it would probably be like in another two years from now. And by then the hype for the show might have died down again. Cause it's only like really popular right now. Cause it was on Netflix like a month ago. So by then the hype's going to be dead. So then who will really care a whole lot? Maybe I'm wrong, but we'll see. So yeah, our next question comes from EK extra and he says, do you think you will do stop motion on your channel one day? Um, honestly, I've tr like I've never like made a video and put it on YouTube, but I have kind of tried stop motion before, and I didn't really care for it. I didn't really enjoy it. I I admire the people that can do it because it takes a lot of time. Like you might think, oh, it's like ten seconds. No, it can take hours, and I just like I don't really have any creative ideas for it, so. I'm open to the idea someday, but for probably the rest of this year, don't don't count on it. <laughs> so, yeah. The next question comes from Jammy J, and he says, "Hi, what is your all-time favorite UCS set? Love the channel, by the way. Well, first of all, thank you very much. I appreciate that. And second, hello, how are you? Um, and to answer the question, I don't really have many UCS sets. I only have two, so I'm gonna go ahead and just say the UCS slave one. It's a gorgeous." beautiful build. Our next question comes from Esme King. I think that's how you say your name. I'm sorry if I said it wrong. He says some stuff and then his question is, what is my favorite original trilogy vehicle? And I'm going to have to say either the ATST or the TIE Fighter. Those are just both gorgeous, beautiful Imperial ships that I love so very much. Alright, and our next question comes from Jawa and he says, what is your favorite Lego Star Wars wave? Mine is this year's summer wave. That is a good wave, don't get me wrong, but I think my favorite is going to be from 2014, the Winter Wave. It's just such a gorgeous wave with mostly beautiful sets. Uh, that's when uh, Micro Fighters became a thing. Unfortunately, I believe that's also when Stud Shooters became a thing though, so maybe it's not that great of a wave after all. Our next question comes from EK Starlord, and he says, What type of camera do you use to do your reviews? I use my phone, which is a Samsung S10 Plus, and so yeah, um, I'm going to turn that question around and ask you guys that question. If you make videos here on YouTube, uh, what do you use to record your videos? I'm assuming you use your phones, so what kind of phone do you have? What do you use? So uh, just let me know in the comments down below. I'm curious to know. Um, so yeah, and our next question comes from the Lego Pork after he says a good bit of stuff. Um, regarding like the music and stuff he says what do you think about star wars squadron squadrons squad squads ones I, I, I don't like that word um, and he says what did you think of the trailer ugh, the trailer and will you get it i'm sorry my voice did a weird thing there um 
I never watched the trailer. I couldn't care less. It's a VR game. I don't have a VR headset or whatever it's called. I don't play VR games and I couldn't care less about a VR game. So because it's VR, I'm not going to get it and I don't really care. So yeah. <laughs> um, being that it's Star Wars, it is cool, but I'm not really into it. Our next question comes from Dark Jedi Films, and I'm probably going to sound like an idiot here. He says a good bit of stuff about the music, um, and then he says, I don't know if someone's asked this before, but what is your favorite faction? I have absolutely no idea what you mean by that. I'm probably being a complete dummy here. Like, are you talking about, like, in Battlefront 2, like, class? Because if you're talking about classes in Battlefront 2, uh, the officer is my favorite class. Um... But if you're talking about something else, then please do let me know what so I can answer in the next episode. So, <laughs> I'm probably just being a complete dummy here and someone's going to point it out. So, yeah. Our next question comes from Whoa, uh, my the w 071717 I don't know how to say your name. I'm sorry if I said that wrong. Um, and he says, do you think the Ahsoka minifigure will go expensive in the next two or five years? Three! Take it or leave it! Okay. And our very last question of the day comes from Vader Bricks, and he says, Have you played Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes? No, I have not, and I don't plan to. I'm not really a huge fan of uh, mobile games like apps and stuff, so I don't plan on playing it ever, and I don't think I ever will, so yeah. And if it ever comes to console like Xbox, maybe then I would consider trying it, but... That would kind of defeat the purpose because it's supposed to be like a mobile game. So, yeah, no, I'm not going to play it. So, yeah. Um, but that's going to do it for today's video. So, thank you all very much for your awesome, amazing questions. Do remember to comment a question down below for next episode. Remember, it can be literally anything. It doesn't just have to be about, like, Lego um, or Star Wars. So, yeah. Um, and leave a like on the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. And until next time, may the swords be with you.